Welcome to the Crimson Daily. Today is Tuesday, March 14th. Lunch today, chicken tenders with a school-made roll or Mexican quesadilla pizza. Lunch tomorrow, popcorn chicken with mini gyro roll or pepperoni calzone with dipping sauce. Now for a look at the news. The club will meet this Wednesday, March 15th at 8 a.m. FBLA has a meeting on Thursday, March 16th at 8 a.m. Sixth graders who are interested in applying for the 7th grade journalism course next year, your language arts teachers have applications. If you have any further questions, you should see Ms. Mundy in the 7th grade hallway. Applications are available now and must be turned by March 31st. Next Friday, March 24th, will be the 10th annual student versus teacher basketball game. Sixth graders will hold a 3-on-3 three -three basketball tournament on March 21st and 22nd from 7.30 to 8.30 a.m. in the gym. Any sixth grade boy or girl can participate. You will need a team of three to six players. The top two teams from the tournament will play the teachers on Friday, March 24th. There will be a girls winner and a boys winner, so start forming your teams and get ready to play. Sixth graders, the cost is $3 a person to enter the tournament and it will cover your admissions fee to the game on March 24th. Student applications to the Art and Innovation Fair are open now on the student information page on its learning. You can apply to A&I Fair with the items you have created in the following categories. Talks and speeches, musical and dramatic performances, technology, video production, art and photography. All applications are due by March 31st. Let's take a look to see more about the A&I Fair is all about. Two seventh graders, Emma Claire and Savannah, are working on a Genius Hour project that focuses on collection donations for a battered woman's shelter. Let's hear more from them now about their project. Already. Hey, my name is Emma Claire and this is my partner Savannah. For Genius Hour, we are spreading awareness on homelessness and respect for women in Forsyth County. We are asking the students of Little Mill to donate old clothes, shoes, socks, canned food, toiletries, etc. Then we will give these donations to a women's shelter called My Sister's House. We have boxes at the end of each grade level's hallway that you can put your donations in. We hope you will join us to help the less fortunate. Remember, any donation is better than no donation. Cheerleading competition tryouts for North Forsyth High School will be held March 28th through the 31st. Football cheerleading tryouts will be held April 11th to April 14th. Thanks for watching, Little Mill. Have a great day!